Hey guys, Patrick Wind here and welcome to this training model in which I'm going to show you how you can create carousel ads within Instagram stories. So in order to do that, I had to create a separate ad set. So within a normal ad set where you have all placements, uh, you do not have the option to create a carousel for Instagram stories. Therefore, you need to create a specific ad set which only has the placement Instagram stories. And if you have this setting, Within uh, this ad set, you can create ads um, that allow you to, uh, to include carousels for your Instagram story. You see this option here, uh, not only single image or single video for Instagram stories, but also a carousel. But let's, do, let's go step by step. An Instagram story, which is, it's actually the easiest format to set up because you simply have to select an image, for example, in the appropriate format. So 16 to nine and, and then give them um, the appropriate link. So rocketsco.com in this specific case. And that's it. So this text you can delete because it's not gonna be displayed if the image has the right format. So if it's 16 to nine, the text is not going to be displayed. However, um, if you would select an image that is for example, one-on-one -on -one, it would actually display the, the copy that you put here. For example, let's say test, test, test. So it would display the copy uh, below the image and it would fade out the color of the image. So in this case, it's gray. So therefore the background is gray and gray. If you would select an image uh, that is not 16 to nine and therefore needs some some uh, some fading out for example in this specific one um, it takes the color of the skin and it fades it out in the skin so you see this is how an instagram story uh, nowadays works but this is of course not the most recommendable way to do it it is much better to actually use an image uh, that is specifically designed for this format and that the text doesn't show up but you included something like this okay that is a very nice way to actually create an Instagram story image. And then of course you can select the different uh, call to action button that shows up below here. For example, as we're down the, down the funnel, we could use shop now, or when we're up a funnel, we could use learn more. And as you probably already see, the way this creative is designed is not very optimal because the learn more button is on in front of this logo in the background and it doesn't really show up that that nicely okay so let's explore what else we can do for example you could easily select the video okay we could upload one or we can simply select one now it comes in very handy to actually filter for the aspect rate ratio here we take full portrait and here for example let's take this one and then we see if he if the if the button is uh, better integrated well that is of course much better you see the difference like in the previous one the learn more bot button was in front of a background which did not really uh, show up that nicely but now <laughs> even with this animation it's super smart because it even motivates uh, the potential customer to swipe up and therefore will increase the click-through rate so that's a good trick in order to get the most out of this ad. And this one is of course much better already having in mind that here the call to action button will show up and on the top on the left, your logo will show up. So that's actually a nice ad. Um, you could even create it already because I like the way this one looks. Nice, and let's also give it a name. Call it price winning Insta story one. So that is already nice. And after we've created this single video care, uh, Instagram story, because uh, I mean, it's basically a GIF, but uh, because it's not just static, but rather animated, it's considered a video, okay? And now what we want to do is we want to create a carousel ad within Instagram story. So how this is actually going to look is basically as if you would have uploaded uh, two or three two or three Instagram stories on your organic page, okay? And it will load one after the other 
just if you would have uploaded two or three um, Instagram stories on your own, okay? So how does this actually work and how does it look like? So once again, we are on ad level and we do not select single image or single video, but we rather select a carousel. And here in the carousel, we can easily uh, select, for example, an image or a video. If you select an image, uh, we could select, for example, this one, but we could also select a video. Let's take aspect ratio for portrait. Now let's take this one, the right resolution, that's good. And let's end it also with a little video. For example, filter, aspect ratio, full portrait. Let's end it, for example, with, with this one. Okay. And now in the preview, we see nicely how this, is, how this actually looks. This carousel ad for Instagram stories, <laughs> you see, basically looks completely as if you would have uploaded it three organic Instagram stories on your profile, on your, on your page and it will basically show them one after the other. And of course, it's not the best idea to start with the static image, so we can now swap a little bit around, uh, change the order, and that's it. We can, of course, send people to a specific uh, URL for each, for each of the cards that we create, and we can select the different call to action button, for example, learn more or shop now in a more uh, aggressive way. So um, that was it. Let's let's save this one also under a cool name. Uh, Price winning Instagram story number two. Let's publish. Let's review it. Nice. Save the draft. And then we are good to go. And then let's also review them. And let's see how it actually looks in real life. So I'm very excited. And... I'm looking forward to seeing the final results of our work. So one of the Instagram stories that we have created, we can already preview. And that's also a very nice trick that I wanted to share with you. When you have those uh, campaigns, I like to give them the number one in front, for example. This way I can e always easily order them. Okay. And it's nice. It's better to, to actually structure my my ad account this way. So for example, here, now we have already created the Instagram story one and Instagram story two. Let's see, let's check out both of them. The first one was just a simple video uh, without the carousel possibility. So you see, uh, it's just one, one path here. But if we switch now to the story, which is a carousel, you see, we take actually up to 45 seconds in total, uh, Ad impression because each of them can be 15 seconds and we can have up to 45 seconds by paying exactly the same price that we pay for just a single one so therefore it was very important for me to actually share this new tool with you that you can create carousel ads in Instagram stories because it's a smart idea to get more exposure by, by paying exactly the same price so guys thank you very much for listening and see you in the next video goodbye <laughs>